If you need to disassemble a small screw that's been locked with Loctite or other thread locking adhesive, like these small 2.5 millimeter Torx, T6 Torx screws in this titanium, these are locked in pretty tight. And some of them we've been unable to remove just using a screwdriver because the torque will twist the Torx bit and or damage the screw heads, but it seems to tw twist the Torx bit first before it does damage the screw heads. But at that point, you're applying too much torque to it. So the trick is to use heat. And from what I read, it takes about 400 to 500 degrees Fahrenheit to break the Loctite bond free. You could do that by putting it in an oven, but then you'd have to wait for it to a certain period of time for it to completely heat up. Or you could use a soldering iron like here, that's been turned up really high to the maximum, almost 900 degrees Fahrenheit, and take the tip of it and put it onto the screw and let it heat for a little while. So here we're using a torque screwdriver that's set to the limit of the torque that you can apply into this T6 head. And you'll see that this one comes undone. It's not clicking. So in this case, the torque screwdriver is clicking Okay, so we're going to have to apply some, um, some heat using the tip of the soldering iron. And so just leave it there for... You're leaning it to the side a little bit so that it kind of makes full contact with the torques because the, the tip is on this soldering iron is pretty fine, but we chose a tip that was uh, small enough to fit inside the head of the torques. Ideally, you'd want the most contact surface area as possible. This is titanium, which is a poor conductor of heat. It's a titanium screw also, so it can take a little bit longer with these titanium screws since you really need to get the heat down in there to break down the thread locker. Go ahead. So you kind of have to work it back and forth like he's doing right now, where um, it helps it come out, because if you just try to go in one direction, it might not work. But right now, doing the back and forth motion is working. All right, so then um, it should come off uh, pretty easily there once you've used the heat to break down the Loctite.